Hey guys, it's Mako on here for a new vlog. Uh, as you can see, I'm uh, I'm uh, the guild. What is it? Warriors Guild, I think, or something like that. I don't know. But I am at the place where you get defenders and uh, your strength cape and attack cape. I was uh, I logged on earlier. Um, today is the 27th of December, 2010. It's like 10 to 9 now. Just watching. Uh, a football match or if you're in America a soccer match so I'm pretty pissed off because my team's losing at half time but you know hopefully we can pull off the victory but still pissed so yeah uh, went out today with piss pants went shopping Christmas sales booyah and then one of the best things happened to me it's really awesome when this happens when you randomly find money right because I came in after I just bought some stuff and I was like, shit, I've not got much money left. And then uh, from and then I, I found these two cards in the living room and they both had 20 quid in. So I was pretty fucking happy. So, yeah, basically got some shoes for free. But yeah, I've just come on here and I had fire giants and I really couldn't be arsed doing fire giants. So I kind of just thought, oh, let's procrastinate and do something else. And then I just thought, hmm, I might go and get a dragon defender. Because just in case I ever want to use it for PvP when it comes back, if I do ever think, oh fuck it, I'll just go and do it, I might need one. So basically, I've come here to come get one, and I've got three. I got, um, I got 800 and something of those points. I only got the combat one, and I brought Myth Armor to do it. Which, yeah, I would advise probably, yeah, bring Myth. Because it's level 92 then, and myth isn't really too bad to be honest. It's uh, you get enough, you get a lot of points, but it's quite, it's quite simple to. I don't, I didn't understand how to get the points on every single one, and I didn't really want to spend the time doing it, so I just did the way I knew. Uh, and you don't need to do anything else. The points just come up on the screen, and then you can just run up and go in, and it lasts ages 800. It's enough to get quite a few. I'm just gonna pause the video because I need to tap in my bank pin. Okay, so I'm back now, and uh, yeah, the only thing I did do wrong is uh, I didn't use an 8 helm, I was using a slay helm for some stupid reason, and I didn't use any super attack potions, or uh, super defense, well I don't need super defense, but yeah, I'll choose one of those, and put that back in there, I don't need that. Uh, I keep those. Oh yeah, and there's a big thing in there called a uh, cyclosis or something. Uh, uh. So yeah, this is yeah. There's this big thing in there called cyclosis, and if you kill it, you get the cyclopean helmet. Or sometimes I think I don't know if it's every time, but I was I was told it was worth a bit. Seventy six k. So that's not too bad. He's quite a high level though, it's like 156 or something, he does hit quite high, so I wouldn't advise to do it, but I just wanted to go because I thought, hey, I want to go, you don't look so tough, so I took it out, I was nice and proud, but yeah, what else do I need, don't need that, don't need my rune, just want some more monks, I'm just going to quickly go back in, just for the last 100, or whatever points I've got left may as well so yeah that's what I'm going to be doing at the moment and then after I will get on with my fire giants task and I don't need to do it but yeah they're just a bit shit because you only get rune skimmies really and then yeah they're just annoying to get to and Matt, no one would sell me any games necklace but I've just got some so that's good apart from that yeah no oh run or seeds I can't get hold of any of those either but yeah uh, stats changes 955k till 97 that's still quite far off and I'll have to use a whip to do this because you needed a defender but I can use a SS for my fire giant stats so I can get some uh, I can get some XP done there um, 149k till 83 slayer which is pretty good 83 will be quite good because I can get D boots from spiritual mages I think they are uh, and then constitution xp if you're interested is 13.46 mil uh, old scape 
who did a video, uh, he does videos as well, I'll give a link to his channel um, in the description or on the screen right now, or something or at the beginning or at the end of the video. You should check out his videos because he's, he's a really awesome guy and he gave me a shout out in the last video and yeah so he is really good at video making uh, well they entertain me anyway and he's just got an awesome voice just listen to his voice it's so like awesome and autopilot ish but yeah uh, it's just hilarious you, you do honestly sound like a 50 year old bloke but anyway yeah join my clan chat which is macro one just my name and there's people in here quite a lot at the time sometimes there's more sometimes there's less but I have to like rank about three people every day so there's lots of people joining because I know cause I have to add them and then rank them and stuff so if you want to earn higher ranks you have to recruit people but, but you start off as just recruit obviously uh, so yeah d -d 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 anything else I wanted to talk about quickly yeah, the uh, mm, uh, in in Altiate's video, he said that it, if basically this uh, the update does happen and they do bring back old RuneScape, by which I mean PVP worlds as they used to be. So if you kill someone, say if I killed him, I'd get Bandos and Fury and D Boots and Whip. Whereas in now, you just get some kind of it's EP and stuff, and you get some kind of items that are random but yeah just in case anyone didn't know all the stuff you get as drops from from pvp like chalices and stuff and statuettes they're not going to become rares some people thought they were if the, if the old worldie comes back and they weren't they're just going to be like dropped by monsters or something like that uh, i've heard that green dragons will still be available they're just going to move them and they won't be in the world eh? well that's what i've heard i don't know if it's true if, it sh if the update happens and i can't get to dragons green dragons any other way apart from going in the world and risking, then I will probably quit RuneScape. Maybe. If the trade limit, I don't know though because the trade limit is going to really piss me off and I know the G, right? And when I say this, right, I am not saying the G will not be there because I'm, re I'm getting really pissed at the moment. So many people trolling on my video. People just coming on my videos. Yeah, it gets me quite a lot of views, those videos where people troll because I got like 300 on my last video. But if you go on it and just look at the amount of people just being such pricks, just like leaving comments saying they're not going to get rid of the GE, stupid and stuff like that. And I'm like, I didn't fucking say they were a prick, you know, it just pisses me off so much when people just like go on a video specifically to troll, right? If you don't like my video, I couldn't give a shit, right? I would not care. I give more of a shit, right, about a bumhole hair of mine falling out than I do you looking at my video, right? So whoever you are, random troll people, you know, just come on my videos, right, fuck off, you know, because you're not clever, you know, you're just an arsehole, right, and you're pissing me off. If you don't like my videos, that's fine. But don't type in RuneScape. Yeah, and the people that troll uh, about RuneScape the game and saying how shit is. You fucking typed in RuneScape, gone on a video, and then trolled, right? You're more sad that you have to take out time out of your life to comment on something to feel important for 15 seconds, right? Because the rest of your life is so shit, right? And that's the truth, you know. So, rant over. Right, but yeah, I am getting pissed with trolls. Right, if you're gonna if you're gonna quote me on something, make sure I've actually said it in the video. Right, seriously, before leaving these daft comments, because it just annoys me. I have to reply to him. But yeah, so I'm not saying they're gonna get rid of the G. What I'm saying is the GE won't work well with the update because if you get rid of max and min pricing. Right, you're going to be guessing to buy something, so it's obviously not going to work like it does now. Where you type it in the item, you click higher or lower, and it sells quick. Right, you're going to be fucking guessing what someone's selling it for, and it could take ages for it to sell. I, I just, it's not going to work well. I just, I, I hope it does, and I hope Jadex have really sat down and got together with all their executives and thought, how are we going to make this work? Because otherwise, we're going to piss off a lot of people. But then a part of me thinks, well, they've pissed me off in the past so many times. I don't. They may not even be doing that. So 
It's hard to say, but if if the update happens and and you know green dragons aren't available and the trade and the GE is fucked up, right? I will be quitting. I will probably. I don't know if I'll give my account away. I'll probably give it to. I don't know. I don't think I will. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna give it to someone. I said Tollscape, I probably would, but that's different because it's Tollscape. But uh, I don't know. I just I just I won't be playing this game. Put it that way. If it happens and. Because I'm not, stand, I'm not, I have to, I really, I don't get on this game enough as it is, right? And I don't have time to be fucking logging in, trolling through forums, trying to find some items to buy. I re I do not have enough time in my day to be doing that. Especially when I get, it's alright in the holidays I've been making videos, but you know when I get back to sixth form, I'm not going to be making this many videos. So if I've got to then start going on the fucking forums to buy monkfish, I'm going to be pissed. Because that, that takes up time. Not, not a lot of people remember, but... It take it took a long time to buy shit back then. Stood around buying, buying, selling, selling. It gets fucking tiring. Just typing it out that many times, it's boring and it ruins the game. The G was the best update they've ever done to this game, in my opinion. And that's in my opinion. So don't again comment. No, it wasn't. It was a shit update. I didn't ask for your opinion, right? I stated mine. I'm entitled to my opinion. You don't like it? Go fuck yourself, right? You know. Fair enough. But yeah, so yeah, I once I've been thinking. Uh, once I'm 99 strength, I might do range, get 99 range through Slayer, because I'd quite like 99 range. I don't mind it. I'm quite good at range. Broad bolts, full void, range void. You know, DFS, not bad. I won't be selling my DFS by the way, because I've got Dragon, Dragon Defender. That is not why I've got it. I just wanted to get it just to see, because you do see some really high levels when they're like wearing awesome armor and they're like, yeah, uh, if you're not training in like defense or strength with a whip and you're just doing attack or something, like once, you, once I've got all the 99s, I may use uh, uh, Dragon Defender on tasks that aren't dragons, because it does make you hit more often and it's only a bit worse strength and you won't really notice it, and the attack bonus will be way worth that, so I, may, I might use it, but yeah, maybe, don't know. But I'm aware this video is getting kind of long now. But I did get a message on my YouTube at the top saying that I have unlimited video, like upload now, which is well, it says long in the 15 minute. I don't know if it's unlimited, but it did say long in the 15. So I don't know what it is now, but whatever. Yeah. So oh, farming 36 farming 1.6k off 37. So when I get to 38, I think it is. I can do a next herb, which is toad flax, I believe, which. That makes you quite a bit of money. It's supposed to be one of the most profitable ones. Yeah, Toad Flax at 38. So I will probably be farming Toad Flax then. Which means I should probably shouldn't have bought all those randos. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. They all make you money. But yeah, that's a good thing. I want to do a farming. I might do a farming run next video. I will do my farming run on camera. Right? Note to self to do that. Uh, someone asked me, sent me a, a message today, my personal messaging on YouTube, which I actually appreciated because if you want a video making, right, it's not just going to get made randomly. If you leave me a comment or message me, it'll probably get made. So he sent me one saying, how do you play Barbarian Assault? Because I want a torso and I've seen that you've got one. How do you, and that's fine, yeah, I can make a video on how to do that. Uh, I mean, I understand that the Defender bit's probably the hardest. A lot of people don't don't know how to do that. I d that's probably one of my favourite roles. It's quite fun once you know what to do. But I can make a video on that because I'd like to call my whip. Anyway. Uh, but yeah. Anyway, I'm dragging on a bit now. Sorry for taking up all of your time. But yeah, thanks for watching this video, guys. Uh, shout out to everyone in my clan. Shout out to Clunge Patrol, Macro One, myself, and Who Prods, and Oldscape again. And David, who, da, 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 who is it? It was in my uh, David Rocks Three because we were doing this together earlier. This uh, mini game, getting the Dragon Defender, and it's not a mini game. I don't know what it is, but anyway, yeah. Thanks for watching. Comment, uh, thumbs up, and subscribe. Macro one out.